Welcome to my favorite third Thursday. See if you can figure out the theme. I'm your host, Sasha Anissa with Orlando Live. City Arts is taken over as well as a whole block party outside. Let's see the spooky art Orlando has to offer. This year, I was very, very happy to uh, collaborate uh, with my model, uh, with Molly. Uh, she was able to do some awesome work with the makeup on the face. Very happy with that. And then obviously, once I, I saw the awesomeness that she did, it was like, oh great, now I gotta top it. Gotta be able to knock it out of the park with the rest of the body painting and so forth. So, but very happy. Uh, and, and to take actually the Lucy character from, uh, from Bram Stoker's Dracula, uh, to the forefront as a hero in a way. Um, I've always loved that character and I always felt like it never really got enough uh, credit. So I, I felt like I needed to do that. This piece, I wanted it to be one of the only ones that I did for the Day of the Dead theme. And this is a dragon skull painted. I didn't know if anyone did anything like that before, so I was a little excited because when I walked around here, I didn't see many like it. So got me really happy. <laughs> There's a lot of assumptions made about um, how women are supposed to be and behave and act, especially as an, an Arab American woman, um, because it's coded in a specific way. So I've painted these uh, thumbs in these constrained and a little uncomfortable positions where they're existing together, but they're kind of separate. I just think it's really important to see representation and people that look like you and have uh, lived a similar experience and I do hope that this is something that reaches people that are not within this um, cultural background because it's something that uh, I think all women experience. There's a very, very limited ability to be yourself without judgment. Now you can see why this event is so much fun. Happy Halloween. Remember to keep Orlando spooky. I mean, awesome. <laughs>